Good day, YouTubers. Um, today, I just wanted to show you my hair. This is a wig that I made. Um, it came out really nice, so I've been getting a lot of compliments on it. So, of course, I had to come onto YouTube and show you girls. So, here's what it looks like. Yeah, I'm on my way to work um, for my part-time job, so I'm wearing all black. And usually, I always wear all black, as you may be able to tell in my videos. But anyway, back to the hair. So, the hair that I got from Best Quality Hair on AliExpress.com, the hair that I wasn't feeling too well, I decided, okay, I wanted to make a wig, so let me just practice on that hair. So, I washed it, I deep conditioned it, and what I did was I left it inside of a plastic cap, shower cap, for two days with the deep conditioner in it and when I took it out it was really soft like before this hair was like really stiff but it, it seems like it's you know it's better mm. when I move when the hair moves now so I'm really happy about that so I've used that hair to practice making a wig um, the 18 inch bundle that I didn't use I put on the bottom the 16 in the middle the 14 on the top and then I have a 14 inch lace closure that I got from Queen Hair um, like probably last spring found it in my hair stash forgot that I had it and I really love this closure like I'm not sure what type of hair this is I totally forgot I want to say it's Brazilian um, like a body wave but the hair is like this closure is the ish like I will be ordering more closures from Queen Hair like yes so I'm really feeling it um, so this is the hair. I'm really pleased with it. So I didn't show um, how I made the wig. I didn't record me making the wig. Um, because I just feel like there are so many um, YouTube videos on other girls making wigs. And after a while it becomes monotonous. I'm not going to show you anything new. I don't have any new techniques. But I did make this wig. And I was pretty proud of myself. I used a dome cap. Um, which I actually love. But I really want to go to Walmart and get the elastic bands um, that everyone's been talking about to make it just tighter, a little tighter. So, um, yes, this is the hair. This is the wig. And last night I just put flexi rods on the hair. So that could have like a little curl, a little body to it. And that's that. Um. But neglecting my own hair underneath with getting all the sew-ins, not, you know, putting oils on my scalp like I should. So I'm going to wear the wig for like a few months um, just to be able to take care of my hair underneath more. And also the hair that I just ordered from H&J, I will probably, I'm probably most likely going to make a wig with that too. I'm just going to order a closure to go along with that. But I'm really feeling this hair, girls. So anyway, I hope that you enjoyed this video. I hope that it was informative. And if you do buy some hair weave and it's extremely dry, try deep conditioning it. Um, I want to say I used a conditioner called Bio Lux that I bought in CVS. Um, I don't have the jar. Sorry, guys. If I can find it, I'll take a picture of it and put it at the end of the video and show you girls what I used. Um, and it really, really made the hair more lively. Um, so anyway, like I said, like I was saying, I hope that you girls enjoyed this video and I hope it was informative and if you liked it, thumbs me up. See you next time.